doll lovers it's ruby Red's world of dolls and welcome back thank you so much for stopping by i hope that all is well fantastic and fabulous your way guys i am here with my gorgeous um alphaba from the um musical wicked um i'm so excited about that movie my daughter and i are planning on going to see it together um so i'm really excited about that i do not plan to buy all of the dolls um <clears throat> I do, um, I think the whole lineup is gorgeous. I did a walkthrough in my local Walmart yesterday. If you follow me on Instagram, you saw my little reel. My local Walmart has completely stocked this collection. They have, the toy section is filled. The aisles are filled and the shelves are filled with toys, but nothing that impressed me. The Barbie section sucked, even though it was filled to the brim. You know, there was nothing new, nothing that tempted me. It was all stuff that I've already seen, um, and I've purchased what I wanted. They have marked down um, in my local Walmart the Disney Descendant, the recent Descendants dolls. I think that's what it is. Um, they've marked them down to $12. Um, it's kind of fast because I think those dolls that just came out, right? But I was tempted to get them, and I did not. I reminded myself of what was going to happen with those dolls if I bought them. So I didn't. But they are so beautiful, those dolls. Their face sculpts and molds are so unique. They're so beautiful. Um, and again, I was so tempted. But I didn't. I did not get them. They have all the Zuru Mini brands, all the Make It Minis. My local Walmart is really stocked. They got the babies in, which they've had those in. They got the mini books. You know, everything is pretty well stocked. So, you know, finally, <laughs> finally. But I'm really excited to get Alphabet out of the box. Um, I do want to get um, Glenda. Um, but this was my favorite one to get. You guys know I told you, you know, it's just something about this green skin and, you know, she's the witch and I just want to, I can't wait to see the movie. You know, the cast is pretty awesome. So I'm going to get Alphaba free from her packaging and, you know, we're going to take a look at her up close and in detail. You guys have, sh I'm sure have seen plenty of reviews on them, but this is my, um, this is my review, you know, my little um, mark on the channel here for when I want to come back later and look at. So I'm going to get her out of the box and we're going to look at her up close. All right. She is free from the box and looking every bit as charming out of the box. I'm just so thrilled that I got her. I was going to pass on these dolls because you guys know I said I'm trying not to you know, collect anything new and be, and when I do, you know, be very, very skeptical, you know, just, you know, but I really am excited that I have her. I, you know, I'm going to put her um, on, I'm going to showcase her on a shelf and display her. And um, yes, I am. I, I just love her. I chose to go with this one because there's so many of her, you know, they've, there's, they, Mateo released every, stage or point um of this doll in the movie i wish that we would have had the opportunities just to get the fashion packs you know like the the sets that like they would do a a package of the all the fashions with the doll because you end up with so many of the doll and i don't want any more of the doll you know you can't her posing is um really good she is articulated it's not made to move but she is a um a good articulated doll. I mean, just look at her. Isn't she isn't she fabulous? I mean, look, come on. I mean, the hat. Here is her hat. Um it is um the plastic rubber hard plastic, but it is very detailed. It's very nice. Very nice, you know? Those gifted people out there could touch it up and give it a more realistic look. And then her her bag um, is really cute as well. Very detailed, as you can see. Um, the strap is really detailed. I'm really impressed with the strap. The strap is the most detailed part of it. And then here is the back. And again, the strap is, you know, got a little give to it. And then you got the handle there as well. But it's really cute. And then here is the doll. Um, I'm really, her hair, I really like her hair. Um, I haven't decided if I'm going to take the elastic. It comes pulled back with a black elastic. I haven't decided if I'm going to take that down. So right now, I'm going to leave it. I mean, her hair, 
you know she has the micro the micro braids it's really soft and it seems to be very full as you can see straight out the box i didn't do anything but just clip one of the sticky ties that i couldn't pull completely out um she does have the molded on um baby hairs as they call them you know <laughs> yeah i don't know what to say about that you know i'm not always that um thrilled about it because they don't do them very well you know all the time but here's her ears her face is gorgeous i mean the face mold and sculpt is gorgeous i love it i love this green skin her hands are so detailed you know i just love it look at that she does have articulation at the wrist shoulder and elbow as you can see um, she has no chest articulation. She has on the molded underwear, and this is what the body looks like underneath. You know, she sits lady-like, <laughs> as we say. And, you know, this is how she sits. So she sits very well. She does not have articulated ankles. Let's see what kind of feet she's got. I think she's going to have, yeah, she's going to have the high heel um, feet and very detailed feet as well. So here's the boot. Here's her boot off. Um, a real stylish boot. I mean, this this is really cool. The buckling detail there. Again, like I said, those very talented people out there can really give this boot a more realistic look. You know, I mean, really. Yep, you can do that. All right, so let me get her boot back on and we're going to look at her dress. I really like the dress. Um really love this dress come on girl if the opportunity present itself i would love to have this dress in my in my collection you know maybe as a costume or something for storyline <laughs> um but i'm gonna leave her as she is but look at all the details on the sleeve here the dress velcros in the back down to the waist um, all the details here on the dress. I mean, it's really nice. Um, I'm really, really excited to have her. You got the detail here. I love the purple. You know, she's just a gorgeous little doll. And I'm just so excited to have her. And I'm just glad that um, she's here in my mini-verse. I mean, look at her. She's gorgeous. She's just gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, yes, she's gorgeous. I love the little out on um, the little school outfit that she wears. Of course, that would fall on the floor. That's what I do. Stuff is always dropping. She does not come with a doll stand. Okay, she doesn't come with a doll stand. Um, this is the basic one for what twenty four? Was she twenty four dollars? I think. Yeah, she was twenty four. Twenty four dollars. I ended up getting her a little cheaper because I purchased her from Walmart. And I had a, they had a sale or something, a coupon. If you spent something, you got something off. So I got her a little less than um, the price point. But she was well worth it. She's well worth the price point. Um, the deluxe doll comes again, like I said, with the broom and a doll stand. And it's a very personalized doll stand. So if at some point that doll goes on sale... Um, I might get that one and because I really love that stand and like I said as a collector if you're just collecting her for showcase purpose you would want her with that customized stand that comes with her um, I've seen reviews of it and it's it's quite lovely um, she's lovely if you just want the basic doll and you don't care about the stand here she is I mean she's absolutely gorgeous a wonderful addition to your collection I mean, <laughs> she's gorgeous. I just love this. I love this. And I'm so glad that I, I got her out of the box. And she's out of that box. And she's here. And, you know, I'm going to have her here on the desk for a while. Welcome, Alphaba. <laughs> Isn't she gorgeous? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So, guys, if you haven't been in your local Walmart toy sections, you might want to pop in and check them out. Because they do have... um. They are stocking stuff right now. This is the time for Christmas, right? This is the time. But like I said, the Barbie stuff is kind of stuff that we've already seen. It's like Mattel is giving us the same stuff. Um, 
the fashionistas or the older ones. I didn't even see the newer one that I've gotten back here that I've rebodied. You know, I didn't even see that wave in there yet. So, like I said, everything seems to be old. I did see some new Chelsea's. I did see some new Chelsea characters. Um... And I'm seeing that Barbie World stuff um, line that they got come out. That came out with all that little furniture sets that we got. With the grill and the outdoor chairs. And then you got the stove um, and stuff. So, yeah. So, I saw that. But that was the nearest thing. And that's been in there for a while. Yeah. But I am excited about the Barbie style that is supposed to release on October 22nd. I'm hoping that I can get my hands on one of those dolls. Because I do have that complete collection. I love that collection. And I'm so glad that they're bringing it back. Um, and the doll is beautiful. It has the beautiful... Um, it has this beautiful sculpt. Is it this sculpt? Yes, I think it's going to have the Andra sculpt. Um, she is gorgeous. Loving her um, fashions. But they're limiting us to, to one. So, you know, I hope that means everybody that wants her can get her. She's absolutely gorgeous. Guys, so make sure you're on the lookout for her October 22nd. That's going to be Tuesday. I think she's supposed to drop our time. It was 12 o'clock. Eastern time is 12. Eastern time is 12. Pacific is 9, I think. But um, I'm definitely getting her. Um, so, again, you know, um, being very cautious of my my ads to the collection because I'm just overwhelmed with them. You know, I'm just overwhelmed with them. Even with my new shelving and trying to set up doll ramas um, for the dolls so I can have all my dolls showcased, I still feel overwhelmed in here. Um, I just feel so overwhelmed. I cannot, for the life of me, find my first skipper that I purchased, the Target exclusive first jobs. Because um, you guys know I showed you guys the second release of the Girl of Color. And then, you know, you got Skipper. And then you got Danielle. Um, I can't find Skipper. Um, I know that Skipper is in this house somewhere, but where she is, I don't know. And I'm getting frustrated. I think she's going to be in the closet here behind me. And if she is in that closet behind me, oh, she's probably going to be in there for a while. Because that closet is jam-packed. And when I open it, I always have to step back because I don't know what's going to fall out. Um, so I might have put her in there because when I come in here and I decide to clean up the doll space, I like for my doll room to be neat. I like for things to be in place. Um, I don't mind things being stacked, but I like for everything to be in a proper place. And I just don't like dolls in the box all on the floor stacked up. You know, I've been there, done that, and you know, I'm trying not to do that. So hopefully I will get my hands on that fine skipper. And then I'm going to set up a little... Use one of my room boxes to set up me a little target, you know, a little small target scene. But yes. All right. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this unboxing and review of Alphaba, uh, my newest member to the miniverse. She's absolutely gorgeous. And I recommend her for your collection. If you love a witch, ha, ah, yes. And especially a witch with swag and style. You know, she, this is the one. This is the one. <laughs> All right, guys, you know the drill. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to check us out on Instagram. We are Ruby Red's World of Dolls there. Continue being awesome, fantastic, and fabulous. And I will see you awesome, amazing people in my next video. <laughs>